I exchange my book. I have written the book with this fellow, Adityari, Professor. So when I gave the book, he smiled. Pramukh Swami, he smiled. Now, that smile, what does it mean? That smile, everybody smiles. But when Pramukh Swami, he smiles, it means something. Will you repeat it to me, all of you? Yes. Will you? Yes. You young fellows? Yes. Sadhus, can I ask? Repeat? Or I should not ask? <laughs> I... I was in the company of Prabhupada Swamiji for 15 minutes. At the end of 15 minutes, I got a great message. What is the message? You are going to repeat with a message. Where? Where, Where there is, there is righteousness, righteousness in the heart, in the heart there, is there is beauty in the character. Beauty in the character. When, there is when there is beauty in the character, beauty in the character there, is there is harmony in the home. Harmony in the home. Harmony in the home. Harmony in the home. When there is Harmony in the home, that is, that gives order in the nation. When there is order in the nation, peace in the world. My meeting Pramukh Swamiji, righteous in the heart, I saw peace in the world. Can you see that? Can you see that? There, there is a righteous heart, there is a peace in the world. That's what I saw today. I was very... It's a bliss, a situation of a bliss. So, Reverend Pramukh Swamiji Maharaj, I just now I saw, and respected Swamiji's, sadhus, devotees, and most of the students who are sitting here, and all of you, my critics. Friends, finally, I want to ask both sadhus this side, young fellows this side, young fellows, and also young women and girls, but all of you would question what we need. What we need, we need, the world needs Prosperity without poverty. Prosperity without poverty. Peace without fear of war. Peace and happy place to live for all the citizens of the nation is what we need. And that's a message is uh, being transmitted from Pramukh Swamiji and he is team from this great place. And I would like to, I am delighted to address, and of course I will address only short time so that you can ask me questions. With the youth of the region, the divine environment of Swaminava and Sasta, with sadhus and students. Friends, I have come to Sarkpur to meet Paramak Swami Maharaj Ji. I am presenting in the personally the book I have written with my friend Professor Arun Tiwari, this guy is sitting here. And uh, name of the book, Transcendence, my spiritual experience with Paramak Swami Ji. This is my very dear project for many years, the day I saw Prabhu Swaji in the Achyadam inauguration at Delhi. I made a promise to Prabhu Swamiji on the inauguration day of Achyadam in Delhi. I will write a book on his great spiritual life. Today we fulfill the promise, the promise.
friends yesterday. I was in the company of three different people. One is Jain Muni and, and another is Haji who has come to go on to Mecca and return. Third is a Swamiji. They all the three of them saw the copy of Transcendence book. All the three asked me one question, what made me to write this book? What made us to write this book? What incident inspired me? I said, Pramuk Swamiji inspired me from the day I met him on 13th June 2001. But one incident deeply touched me. One incident deeply touched me, that is on the next day, of terrorist attack on Chattam, Gandhi Nagar. On 25th September 2002, two, there were many bodies of devotees and also terrorists who were killed in the attack. Ramak Swamiji comes with the Ganga Jal in his commander and showed it on each of the body without any discrimination, be it a duty or the security personnel or the attackers. He silently, silently displayed to the world that every human life is sacred. Life comes from one God and return to the only God. His magnanimity gave me the urge and strength to explore the spiritual life of Pramukh Swamiji and bring out this book with my friend Arun.